play Young Man by Justin Timberlake. We're in standard tuning. We've got a capo here on our fourth fret. We've got two chords, a D chord and an A chord. If you know how to play those chords, go ahead and skip ahead here. I'll be teaching you how to play those real quickly here. For a D chord, your index is on the second fret, the G string. One, two, three strings up. That's your third string there. Middle finger is on the highest string, your high E string, second fret. Ring finger is on the third fret of the B string. Here's your D chord. For your A chord, well, one more thing on the D chord. You don't play this low E or the low A, you just play these four strings. For your A chord, you have your middle finger on the third string down of the second fret. That's your D string. One, two, three strings down. Your ring finger gets tucked right under that one on the second fret of the G string, and your pinky gets tucked under your ring finger on the second fret of the B. So all those fingers are sandwiched in there on the second fret. And you play all the strings except for this low E. So there's your A chord. Now let's talk about the progression here. So if we go from D. So most of the time we're on the D chord here, and we'll talk about the strumming here in a second. So we're going to do, we're going to stay on our D chord, pick the root note D, which is your third string down, let that ring, and then we're going to go up, down, up, down, up. So pick the root note, strum down, up, down, up, down, up. And then we're going to go down, down, switch to our A, and let that ring. So most of the work there, like I said, is done on this D chord. So pick the root note, strum down, up, down, up, down, 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 A. And then if you want to get fancy, you can do a little up, down, up on the A. Nice and slow. all there is to it. So it's just those two chords and you're staying on that D chord for most of the time. You really just sit on that A chord for a brief period of time there. So that's going to be it for this tutorial. If you have questions, please comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.